What's poppin'? What's poppin', family? Hold on, before we get into this video, okay, I wanna let you guys know, you might know already, this song, right, is is uh the Kid Leroy song, really. Even though it's it has JK and uh, Central C on it, it's I think this song is like the Kid Leroy song and it's gonna be on his album. Therefore, it's not it's not big hit releasing the song, which means Bro, they blocking, they blocking niggas' reactions, bro. <laughs> they blocking, they blocking niggas' reactions. You either have to have a blurred screen, and it's like, not only is a blurred screen not enough to upload a reaction from the song, but you kind of got to skip through the song. You can't really listen to the song fully if you want to react to it. I'm going to try to get around it, and if they still take their... <laughs> Still take this reaction down. They some scheming motherfucker. But anyways, what's going on? It's your boy. You know what I'm saying? Nigel Baker, aka C Breezy, Ursha, or Michael B. Jordan. Whichever one you think I look alike the most. You know what I'm saying? You let me know. So okay, so this is this is gonna be like a kind of like a thoughts on the song. You know what I'm saying? It gave me the type of vibe where it's just like um obviously the lyrics. Uh, if we had the chance and the time to spend, would you do it again? Like, I think like to me, it's talking about like your little sneaky link. You know what I'm saying? And I, I was well, let me not say that because we faithful around here. You know what I'm saying? Black men don't cheat like that. No, we don't cheat at all. You know what I'm saying? Junk cook 20% black. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Just somebody that you you don't really intend to have like relations with, but you just like the company. And by company, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? If we had the chance, would you do it again? Uh, or was it too much? Like, was the vibe too much for you? Like, was I just too much to handle? Like, could you could you not? You know what I'm saying? Could you not handle the the connection? You know what I'm saying? Like, was it too much? But was what too much? Oh, was what too much? Jk. Let, let me stop, because I already know how your freaky mind get. And then after that, I just think the verses kind of followed the chorus, obviously. I really enjoy that the Kid Leroy, even though this is like his song, I really enjoy that JK had like the entire chorus. I really do respect the Kid Leroy for that. The Kid Leroy for that. It didn't seem like a song that the Kid Leroy just threw together and just wanted JK on the song because he thought it was gonna, or he knew that it was gonna produce numbers. It actually seemed like the Kid Leroy gave a, a solid verse. I enjoyed his parts. I just feel like JK, like he knows not only how to make a good record, a great record, but he knows how to keep like songs stuck in your head. Like he knows how to make things sound good and catchy. Like it's like, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Like, like he's a hit machine. And I think that's why when he is featured on a song, I make sure I listen hard to see if it was just like, just to get views, just to get, you know what I'm saying, numbers up, just to get uh, another artist popping. I listen closely to see if like everyone's verse sounds really good and if everyone's verse and, and if everyone's verse is actually like not, like not a throwaway verse. You know those songs where it's like, you know an artist could have done, could have done better, but it's just like a throwaway song. Like sometimes, bro, I heard this one, I'm not gonna say the artist, but I heard this one song, bro. Obviously, sometimes when artists collab, they're usually not in the same studio. Sometimes they are, sometimes they're not. Most of the time they're not. But it's like, bro, this this artist was a feature on another big artist song. The artist whose song it was sounded like it was perfectly recorded. Like the verse was good, everything, you know what I'm saying? Sounded great. The feature was I, like, you know the artist. I'm, I'm just not gonna say, but you know the artist I'm talking about. But it sounded like they recorded off of like off of an iPhone, bro. Off of a Blackberry. Off of a pager. Like it sounded like the audio was terrible. But it's a big artist. In those cases, it's it's obvious that you're not really on the song to make a good record for the fans and for the supporters. Like you're just on the song just because of the money, just because of the numbers, the views. When any of the BTS members are featured on a song, I make sure I listen hard to see if like everyone came together to just to, to make a great record. JK is strategically getting these heavy hitters in in the pop scene right now, right? To cross over into the pop culture because I think he's honestly a fan of the pop culture. Bro, I think he's just trying to wake everyone else up when it comes to this scene because bro, ARMY, we know. <laughs> we know that JK is the guy. Like we know he's him. But just like me, I, I caught on to BTS maybe about three years ago. And before that, I had no idea how talented these guys were. So I think I think he's trying to strategically wake everyone else up. Wake everyone else up in this in the 
in the pop scene and really ma like make his presence known. I think I use the example a lot of the times where you know how like, and, and you do this all the time. You don't use your signal when you get over. You just cut people off, and that's fine. I'm not. I'm not trying to say that you that you're a bad driver. It's just that once you like, if you were to use your signal to get in front of me, I would be like, okay, that's fine. You know what I'm saying? It's just you know what I'm saying a car trying to get over into my lane, right? But if you just cut me off. I'm going to notice you more. I'm going to pay a little bit more attention to you. And I think that's exactly what JK's doing. I think he's trying to get into this into this scene, into this lane, and not use his signal because he wants his presence to be known. And I'm super happy that JK is, bro, he's he's showing out for ARMY, bro. Like, he's making not only ARMY, but, like, BTS as a whole just, like, look really good. And maybe, I don't know, maybe it's like, maybe it's like once he gets into this scene and then once BTS, once they come back in 2025, it's like more of like the western pop culture eyeballs will be on the group because of what jk has been what he's been completing with these with these side missions and stuff like that right super proud of jk and this was i think i think his verse was really good okay hold on let me not I really enjoyed the Killer Roy's uh, verse, and I extremely enjoyed when he came on after Central C. When he, bro, he was sliding. Where is it at? Right here. Right there. I'm not. I can't play the whole thing, obviously, but he was sliding. The Killer Roy's verse. I really enjoyed. And like I said, it really seemed like he put thought and like effort into the song. You get what I'm saying? Like it wasn't it wasn't just a a, a business thing. Kid Leroy is super talented, bro. So I I wasn't expecting to not like his verse. Uh let's go to Central C, okay? Uh first and foremost, I don't know how many convenience stores he's robbed. <laughs> oh! But I know, I know you. <laughs> I know it's more than a handful. I know it's more than a handful, bro. Central C. I really, really, really enjoy Central C's music. He just, to me, in my opinion, I don't think that he fit the song, bro. I just, I just don't think that this song fits him. Like, I don't think the beat fits him. I don't think this is his, this is his vibe. Like, um, I don't think this is a Central C feature song. Was his verse bad? No, I just don't think think it uh it's just like to me bro it's just not i just don't think it fit i just don't think it fit but all in all bro i'm gonna make this short and sweet all in all i think that i would i would i would definitely give this song still a 6.5 uh i'm gonna keep the same rating that i that i rated it when when uh, we watched the full thing on patreon and you know what i'm saying things can't really get blocked over there i'm just i'm just, I'm just saying so you know what i'm saying <laughs> i'm not trying to throw a shot at the actual label i'm just saying on patreon <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Oh, <laughs> but anyways, I think the song was pretty, pretty good. It wasn't super fire, but I think it was, I think it was pretty good. That's just my opinion. You can hate me or love me for it. It's just my opinion. 6.5 for me, man. Um, man this just Uber. You know it's serious when you like, he, like he was like, he was spitting, right? He was sliding. I just couldn't really, I couldn't really rock with it. Like, I don't know if, if the flow was a little off. I don't know, bro. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think about the song. You guys let me know how you like Central C's verse. Let me know what you thought of um the song as a whole. I would love to hear you guys' opinions. Let me know in the comments down below. But other than that, bro, hopefully this video does not get blocked, dog, because I didn't even watch the video. I was literally looking at pictures, bro. Like, yeah, I love you guys so much. If you guys want to see the full, um, the full video, it's up on my Patreon right now as we speak yeah go check it out my uh, patreon link is in the description down below or it is going to be somewhere linked on the screen uh or you can actually click that link right here that just popped up above my box but uh i love you guys so much be safe out here and uh let me know what you think about the song all right peace out i have been you know what I'm saying i'm kind of nervous because like i said i've been thinking about doing this for the entire week but hey i think i'm ready to graduate straight kids university one point per round this game is just for fun, not for me. I'm trying to graduate. <laughs> I'm trying to graduate. Is that Chan? Is that Bang Chan? Bang Chan, Bang Chan, Bang Chan, Bang Chan. Bang Chan. What the fuck? Felix. <laughs> help me, help me, please. Help me, help me, please. Help me, help me. Fuck. Wow, now people are doing covers of their songs. That is pretty crazy, bro. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Dramatic. Happy birthday. I'm just Is his birthday? birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm Joey's like, bro, shut Get out! Get out! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Shame, bro. Like, how the hell did he do this shit? Ah! 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 I know them fans! I know them fans! I know them fans! Ah!